guys. Today I would like to introduce you our brand new feature, our fire alarm uh, system. You know, many of our competitors are selling big products uh, for uh, a lot of money to solve fire alarm. In Luxon it's included. We have fire alarm detectors in our program. They are connected with with air, we have a um, temperature sensor. And this brings me to a, a big point. Um, a temperature sensor can be used as a fire alarm detector because when the temperature goes um, higher than a, a certain level, it's possible to say, this must be fire. And this is also the way how we design our fire. So I. Um, place a new fire alarm block in my program. This fire alarm block is in principle already programmed. I give it a room, see it's room central, make a double click and I see that all my smoke detectors are already uh, assigned. I would like to have my alarm in this uh, music server zones. That means if fire uh, or smoke is detected, the music server zones should play a loud uh, fire alarm sound. And then I would like to assign this temperature sensor. This is a temperature sensor where uh, Luxon Config knows this must be a room temperature, not any other temperature. So I send this. And then I, I have some additional temperature sensors in my programming. I have, I have them here, I make a copy, I paste them uh, in my fire alarm page, so, um, paste, and you, you see we have some inputs, these are external smoke detectors and these are temperature inputs. We wire them. And this is everything you have to do. It is already programmed. You have uh, certain uh, alarm outputs, a pre-alarm, a main alarm, and then uh, for a serene, because you can uh, mute this uh, serene. Um, you do not have to make um, the fire alarm uh, on, uh, switch it to an online mode, because it always has to be online. So please, try it out and give us feedback. Thank you for today.